Melissa Ann McCarthy, born August 26, 1971, is an American actress, comedian, writer, producer, and fashion designer. She is the recipient of numerous accolades, including two Primetime Emmy Awards and nominations for two Academy Awards and two Golden Globe Awards. McCarthy was named by Time as one of the 100 most influential people in the world in 2016, and she has been featured multiple times in annual rankings of the highest paid actresses in the world. 234. McCarthy began appearing in television and film in the late 1990s, and first gained recognition for her role as Sookie St. James on the television series Gilmore Girls, 2000-2007. She played Dina on the ABC sitcom Samantha Who? 2007-2009, before starring as Molly Flynn on the CBS sitcom Mike and Molly, 2010-2016, for which she received the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Lead Actress in a Comedy Series in 2011. McCarthy's appearances as a host on Saturday Night Live led to a win for the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Guest Actress in a Comedy Series in 2017. McCarthy gained critical acclaim for her performance in the comedy film Bridesmaids, 2011, receiving a nomination for the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress. She went on to star in several commercially successful comedies, including Identity Thief, 2013, The Heat, 2013, Tammy, 2014, St. Vincent, 2014, Spy, 2015, and The Boss, 2016. She also expanded into dramatic roles by portraying Lee Israel in the biographical drama film Can You Ever Forgive Me? 2018, for which she received a nomination for the Academy Award for Best Actress. McCarthy and her husband Ben Falcone are the founders of the production company On The Day Productions, under which they have collaborated on several comedy films. In 2015, she launched her own clothing line for plus-sized women, named Melissa McCarthy 77, and she received a motion picture star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. 5-6. McCarthy was born in Plainfield, Illinois to Sandra and Michael McCarthy. 7-8. She is a cousin of actress and model Jenny McCarthy and professional basketball player Joanne McCarthy. 9. McCarthy was raised on a farm in a large Catholic family. Her father is of Irish descent, while her mother is of English. Canadian, and Irish ancestry. 10 11 12, some of her forebears were from County Cork. 13, she graduated from St. Francis Academy, now Joliet Catholic Academy, in Joliet, Illinois. 14, her career started with stand-up comedy in Los Angeles, and later in New York City. 15, McCarthy is an alumna of The Groundlings, an improvisational and sketch comedy troupe based in Los Angeles, California. 16, McCarthy made her first television appearance in an episode of the NBC comedy series Jenny, opposite her cousin Jenny McCarthy. She made her feature film debut in a minor role in the 1999 comedy Go, and later had roles in the movies Drowning Mona, Disney's The Kid, Charlie's Angels, The Third Wheel and The Life of David Gale. She also worked in three episodes of Kim Possible, voicing D and Amy. 17. In 2000, McCarthy was cast as Sookie St. James, the upbeat and klutzy best friend of Lorelai Gilmore, on the WB television series Gilmore Girls. Throughout the series, Sookie is Lorelai's business partner and cheerleader. 18. On April 7, 2016, McCarthy announced on the Ellen DeGeneres show that she would be returning for the show's revival, Gilmore Girls, A Year in the Life, on Netflix. 19. The latter was released November 25, 2016 and McCarthy appears in one of its four episodes. In 2007, she starred opposite Ryan Reynolds in the science fantasy psychological thriller The Nines, written and directed by John August. She later starred in the independent comedies The Captain, Just Add Water, and Pretty Ugly People. 20. Also in 2007, McCarthy starred as Dina Stevens on the ABC sitcom Samantha Who? 21. McCarthy played Samantha's socially awkward childhood best friend, whom Samantha hasn't seen since seventh grade. When Samantha wakes from her coma, Dina convinces Samantha that they have always been best friends. While Andrea eventually forces her to reveal the truth, Samantha still remains friends with Dina. 22. She guest starred in Rita Rocks and on Private Practice. 23. In 2010, McCarthy played supporting roles in films The Backup Plan and Life as We Know It. 24. On September 20, 2010, McCarthy was cast in a leading role on the CBS sitcom Mike and Molly. 25. In 2011, 
McCarthy had a breakout performance in the comedy movie Bridesmaids alongside Kristen Wiig, Maya Rudolph, Rose Byrne, Wendy McClendon Covey and Ellie Kemper. McCarthy received an Academy Award nomination for her performance. In fall 2011, after achieving fame from Bridesmaids, she received her first Emmy Award for Outstanding Lead Actress in a Comedy Series for her role on Mike and Molly. 2627. In June 2011, she hosted the Women in Film Crystal Plus Lucy Awards. 28. McCarthy later had supporting roles in This Is 40, 2012, the spin-off to Judd Apatow's film Knocked Up, 29, and The Hangover Part 3, 2013. She was invited to join the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences in June 2012 along with 175 others. 30. McCarthy hosted Saturday Night Live on October 1, 2011, April 6, 2013, February 1, 2014, February 13, 2016, and May 12, 2017. 31. She was nominated five times for a Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Guest Actress in a Comedy Series for her appearances on the television show from 2011 to 2017, winning in 2017. 27. In 2013, McCarthy co-starred in the crime comedy Identity Thief with Jason Bateman. 32-33, Identity Thief opened at number one at the box office, and grossed $174 million worldwide 34, despite negative reviews. 35. In 2013, McCarthy co-starred with Sandra Bullock in the buddy cop comedy The Heat. The film was released in the United States and Canada on June 28, 2013 to both critical and commercial success. 36. With McCarthy being called box office gold, The Heat grossed $229 million worldwide. 37. McCarthy co-wrote the script for the movie Tammy, which was released on July 2, 2014. McCarthy's character loses her job and her car, and then learns that her husband has been unfaithful. To get away, she is forced to rely on her alcoholic grandmother, Susan Sarandon, for transportation as they embark on a journey of self-discovery. 38. McCarthy produced a CBS pilot which starred her husband, Ben Falcone. 39. McCarthy played the female lead, opposite Bill Murray, in the 2014 comedy film St. Vincent, directed and written by Theodore Melfi. 40. On November 19, 2014, it was announced that McCarthy would portray fairy heroine Tinker Bell in the untitled comedy adventure directed by Sean Levy. 41. She would also produce the film. 42. In addition, McCarthy was the lead and frequent collaborator Paul Fagg's spy comedy Spy, 2015, 43-44, a role that earned McCarthy her first Golden Globe Award nomination.